It's been a long Valley bus drivers back on the road starting tomorrow. The majority of drivers voting in favor of a new contract just hours ago. Yeah, it's great news for the 80,000 people who ride the Phoenix bus every day. ABC 15's Ashley Thompson joining us live from Central Station downtown. And Ashley, how do bus drivers feel about the new contract? They're pleased. They say no one wins when there's a strike, but full service doesn't begin until tomorrow. So you could still see sounds like this at Central Station showing you which routes have been affected. After seven days of picketing, bus drivers have agreed to return to work. And I think we got what we needed for now. The contract gives drivers increased vacation time and improved benefits. They will get a little less than the 3% raise they were offered last week, but union reps say this didn't come down to money. Sometimes it's not about dollars and cents. It's about recognizing the humanity of a person. A bathroom break is much more important than an extra dollar. Speaking of bathroom breaks, the contract still pretty vague about when and where drivers can go, saying both TransDev and the union will work to find solutions for unclean and unsafe bathrooms. To have to wear depends is dehumanizing to someone who's not necessarily needing to wear those types of of. Uh, Diapers. Phoenix Mayor Greg Stanton applauding both sides for compromising. People have the opportunity to take this bus to doctor's appointment, grocery stores, all the things that they want to get done. Uh, families rely on this uh, bus service. And TransDev just released this statement on the deal. It says, we are very pleased that our operators overwhelmingly approved a new five-year contract. We look forward to getting our employees back to work and returning to 100% bus service tomorrow morning. But this fight may not be over for good at today's meeting. Bus drivers making it very clear that they want to become public employees in the future. Well, we are all back very pleased that it's over after all of this. Thank you so much, Ashley.